when you use a tobacco product, you're putting 4,000 chemicals into your body. And your body has to process all those chemicals. So all the organs in your body are being stressed. You know, it's actually safer. Other than carbon monoxide, it's actually safer to suck on the exhaust of a car than it is a cigarette. Who would do that? Look, you have health class. You know what tobacco can do. You know about cancer and heart disease and all that kind of stuff. And what you're probably not thinking about is your brain. Nicotine is going to enter your brain. It's the most vital organ you have in your body. It's going to change the way your brain works, and you're going to do it to yourself. Nobody's going to addict you. You're going to addict yourself. It's a personal choice. But once you've made that choice, you can't change it back. Your brain is going to be changed for the rest of your life. And you're screwing with the most vital organ you have in your body. It's who you are. And you're about to change it with a drug called nicotine. It doesn't make any sense. The one thing about drug addiction is what you do today to your body, you won't feel today. You might feel it six months from now. Drug addiction is a process by which we slowly change all the organs in our body over time. It's still your choice.